A Taiwanese delegation joined Palau's 25th Independence Day celebration on October 1st. The delegation was led by Council of Indigenous Peoples Minister Yi Chiang Perord, who was appointed special envoy by President Tsai. Minister Perord sat down with Palau President Thomas Romangasau Jr. and conveyed President Tsai's congratulatory greetings. Fireworks lit up the sky at Palau's 25th Independence Day celebration. Thousands of Palauans gathered outside the president's office to witness this moment in history. I am delighted that the strong partnership between our countries, founded on our shared values of freedom and democracy. At the Independence Day celebration, the Master of Ceremonies read a diplomatic letter from Taiwan's president, conveying her good wishes to the people of Palau. The Minister of the Council of Indigenous Peoples attended the celebration as a special envoy of Taiwan. The day before, he paid a call on the President of Palau and presented a diplomatic letter of congratulations. I understand uh, President Tsai Ing-wen is, uh, uh, herself is a strong advocate and supporter of the Austronesian culture uh, because she's a Paiwan. Huh? Yes. Mm. Uh, and uh, uh, please extend to her my appreciation and for her support in this area. The First Lady has been attending the conference and she informed me that uh, an interesting point is that we may have all originated from uh, one, one place or one source of uh, culture. Regarding what the President had said involving future exchanges between the Austronesian-speaking peoples, we will continue our exploration together on language, culture, and even issues related to climate change. The head of the Council of Indigenous Peoples remarked that a coincidence had brought him and Palau's president together. It so happens that in 2008, when his term expired, I too left my post due to a power transition in Taiwan. I couldn't have imagined I'd be back 11 years later to work at the Council of Indigenous Peoples and that he'd be back as president. I feel that President Remengasau and I have a very special connection. Hosted by Palau's president, the Taiwan delegation attended a state banquet where indigenous students were invited to perform. The delegation not only advanced Taiwan's cultural ties with the Pacific nation, but also deepened a valuable diplomatic friendship.